Right now, Caltrans is in the East Bay surveying damage storm-related to the roads, causing major delays near Sinole. Yeah, part of the State Route 84 washed away into the Alameda Creek, leaving only one lane open. So one-way traffic controls are now in place just east of Palomares Road. ABC 7 News reporter Lena Howland is joining us live there now with a look at the damage now left behind. Good morning, Lena. Good morning, Julian. We are at the roadblock set up by Caltrans crews here behind me where this stretch of the highway is now down to one lane traffic controls. They're doing this now because Caltrans says it's just not safe to drive on the lane closest to the water, which they say took on some major damage during last night's storm. An aerial view shows a portion of State Route 84 cracked and slipping into the Alameda Creek on Monday morning, throwing a major wrench into some President's Day plans. Oh my God, yes. how do we get to our home? Caltrans says this happened around 5 o'clock in the morning on Monday, and they're calling it a slip out. When the roadway gets eroded, the, the ground underneath it kind of washes out, then the pavement slips down. Right, or, or, or becomes unnavigable, so we can't have people driving on it. So that's what's going on out there right now, and we're going to need to make a repair before we can open the road all the way back up. Caltrans crews are now out doing one-way traffic controls in the area from Pleasanton Road on Highway 84 to Washington Boulevard. Drivers stuck in traffic told us they were surprised to see the damage after getting so little rain Sunday night. Didn't expect this for just this rainfall. Like it, it's it isn't that hard, right? For this rain, I didn't expect any blockage here. But but Caltrans says they don't have an ETA of clearing the slide just yet. We've had our maintenance engineers take a look at it, so it's safe to traverse in in one direction. Uh, but what we'll have to do um, as soon as we get them out there is have construction engineers take a look at what needs to be done in order to repair the road. Then once we know what that is, then we can go ahead and take the steps to get the materials and the crews in to rebuild. CHP has confirmed that they will be doing a complete closure of both lanes of this highway, and that will start tonight at 5 o'clock. Caltrans says locals can use Palomares Road to get around this. Live in Alameda County, Lena Howland, ABC 7 News.